Good afternoon, this is the Blue Radio News Update. My name is Diana Wamboy. The Kenya Kwanzaa Coalition has unveiled its seven-member team that will represent the government in the bipartisan talks with the opposition. Kakamega Senator Boni Halwale, elders member of parliament Adan K. Nan, his Kibwezi counterpart Mwengi Mutuse and Taita Taveta woman representative Lydia Haika are among the seven-member delegation that will spearhead the talks. As a Miola Umoja One Kenya Coalition unveiled its seven-member team on Thursday, April 6th, during a parliamentary group meeting in Machakos. The talks were proposed by President William Ruto when he urged Azimio leader Raila Odinga to call off the anti-government protests. Police in Mombasa have arrested four suspected gang members believed to be behind a string of robberies in Likoni. Their arrest is part of ongoing efforts by the police to bring peace and security to the area. Likoni Police Commander Timothy Muasia said the police will continue pursuing other gang-affiliated members to maintain peace in the area. The suspects are scheduled to appear in court today. Investments, Trade and Industry Cabinet Secretary Moses Kuria has announced the lifting of the ban on the exportation of raw macadamia for one year. Speaking in Kirinyaga, the CS said the decision was made in response to the falling prices, which have dropped to as low as 20 shillings per kilogram. The CS further said that suspending the ban will attract buyers worldwide and allow farmers to sell their nuts at higher prices. Macadamia nuts are primarily grown in central Kenya. The highly anticipated launch of the Typhoon 1 satellite has been postponed by 24 hours due to poor weather conditions. SpaceX, a US-based company that manufactures and launches the world's most advanced rockets and spacecraft, announced a delay in the lift of the Falcon 9 rocket, which will be transporting Typhoon 1 alongside other satellites to the orbit. The Ministry of Defense and the Kenya Space Agency released a statement in the morning citing unfavorable upper-level wind conditions that would have affected the rocket's flight trajectory as the reason for the delay. That's the news update. My name is Diana Wamboe. You're listening to Blue Radio Bringing the Vibe Playing you the best of East Africa.